This weekend is the third edition of the Reims International Modern United Nations, which means that it is a diplomatic simulation where each student plays the role of a diplomat at the UN. Well, we have different comedies, so each comedy has a different topic or a different crisis. So it all depends on which committee you're in. So for example, we would have the crisis committee, which is facing a fictional war between Iran and Israel. Or you can have the UNEP committee, which is focused on the environmental problems, such as coastal erosion. We have 16 different partner universities around the world. We have most of the Sciences Po campuses, but it's not just that. We have people from the UK, people from uh, the Czech Republic, people from Gambia, from Russia. I'm chairing the UNESCO committee uh, with my friend Tim and uh, we'll be organising that committee so everyone can have a great debate. And I uh, came to Ryman because we heard such great things about it. Uh, we had some friends who came here last year and they recommended it to us so uh, Reading decided to try and get some people to come along. So yesterday night was the opening ceremony. It's a traditional inaugural address. I hope you'll have really fruitful debates. We have an inaugural address given by a guest speaker on a topic which is related to MUNs. We are simply entering into precisely a multipolar world in which the wealth is distributed among an increasing number of actors. During this weekend, I will be invested in the economic and social committee. I will defend the Swiss position. I'm from India, and for this um, MUN, I'll be representing Lebanon. I'm a delegate from Lebanon at the UNICEF, and I'll be discussing how we, as a country, are aiming to counter child marriages, as well as the problem of Syrian refugees in Lebanon. I'm Iran in the crisis committee, and therefore the script of the crisis committee is that um, I, Iran, develop weapons of massive destruction, a nuclear weapon. And the Israeli, as a preemptive measure of self-defense, attack, attack Iran and kill 14 of my civilians. And I respond by killing three. So, I mean, I, I, would like, I would like, and it's true, to find a diplomatic solution to the, to the conflict. We have the privilege to represent the Russian Federation at the Crisis Committee. And therefore, I will be uh, the delegate in this community, trying to both defend the interest, uh, the strategic interest of my country, and also to try to find a negotiated solution. I think for many people, it's not so much professional or career-inspired. It's much more about having a discussion about things we actually like talking about. So, uh, you see, all of the topics that are on, on the committees are things we could discuss in between us. And it's nice to have a formal kind of simulation to structure the debate.